so today I'm going to do a yarn comparison video. I used to do these a lot uh, a long time ago and they kind of just went away and I've had a lot of people ask me if I would start doing them again. Well sure, sure I will. I really enjoy anything that has to do with yarn whether it be showing you new yarns, comparing yarns, uh, just anything making stuff with yarns. If it involves yarn, I'm all in. So, okay, so today I'm gonna be comparing um, a Red Heart uh, Super Saver Ombre, which a, a lot of people are probably, probably familiar with because it has been out for a while. And I'm going to be comparing it to something that's a little bit newer. It's quite new, um, but you still might have already purchased it. It's, um, it's Yarnspirations Caron Jumbo Ombre. So, most of you probably know, and if you don't, I'm going to tell you now, that Yarnspirations is um, based in Canada. They make uh, Caron, Bernat, uh, Patton's. Um, they bought Red Heart yarns. So they also own Red Heart too. So, but they kept the brand name Red Heart. They didn't change it to Yarnspirations. So they are both um, owned by Yarnspirations. So in case you didn't know that, that was a fun fact. That happened last year. Uh, Red Heart did sell out to Yarnspirations. So anyways, uh, Red Heart Super Saver Ombre has been out for a while, like I said. Now, I always think, and I've always thought, that Red Heart, out of all the ombres, um, as far as color-wise goes, I think Red Heart makes the best ombre, as far as the same color change is so, the color change, like this is all pink, is so subtle that you can't even hardly notice the change. It's just, it's just so subtle from light to dark. Um, and it's a beautiful ombre effect. I've had lots of people ask me, hey, what's your favorite ombre? Well, color wise, the Red Heart Super Saver beats them all because, in my, that's my personal opinion. By the way, the colors fade from light to dark so subtly, it's just, it's beautiful. Um, feel of it though is that of Red Heart Super Saver. It's not the softest yarn in the world, but that's what it is. It is a super saver value yarn. Um, so, you know, it's a four weight value super saver yarn. Colors, though, are gorgeous. Now, the super saver, Red Heart Super Saver, been around for a while. So, uh, the ombres. So, you know, they have probably, if I had to guess off the top of my head, 18, 19 colors available. That's a lot of colors to choose from. You know, it wasn't always like that. They've added colors to their collection over time. And the yardage wise, it is a medium weight number four, which I agree with. Um, and it's 100% acrylic. Um, yardage wise is 482 yards per skein. Now you can pretty much buy this anywhere that you want. You can buy it on your serrations, you could buy it at Walmart, Joann's, and Michael's pretty much anywhere that they sell yarn you could buy this now the average they you know you can find it it's more or less uh, different places but I'm gonna average it out at about eight dollars uh, a skein for this uh, now we're gonna move on to the newer one the Caron um, jumbo ombre now a very pretty now the ombre effect on these I do have a couple of them. It is subtle as well, but not as good as the Red Heart, in my opinion. You can see that it does break break here with the bright white. For some reason, I have no idea why they threw that threw that in there. I guess it's 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 kind of a light, really extremely extremely light green, um, but and. And it does go to lighter to darker uh, but again the ombre effect on this is is very pretty it would be second to the red heart out of all the ombres i've ever seen in my life um these would be second best in color wise as far as the slow ombre effect 
that it makes. Here's another color of it. It is quite pretty, and like I said, the ombre effect isn't that bad on them. It does change slowly, but not quite as subtle as the Red Heart does. And here's another one. They all got that white in them for some reason. Now these, um, I have only found them on uh, Yarnspiration's website and Joann's online. Um, but they're new. And they only have five colors, oh, five, uh, four. No, five colors available at the moment. I only have four because they were sold out of one of them. Five colors available at the moment. So the colors are limited on these versus the Red Heart. Uh, yardage wise, oh, softness though. It is softer than the Red Heart, um, quite a bit. Um, it's not the softest yarn. It's definitely <laughs> softer than the Red Heart though. But the Red Heart will soften up after a wash. But yes, as far as the feel goes, it is definitely uh, softer. Uh, let's check out the yardage. It is a medium weight number four. Yes, yes. Um, let's see, we said the Red Heart had um, 482 yards, and I said I'm going to average it out about $8. You can find it cheaper some places and more some places, but it averaged about $8. This one has 595 yards. So we'll say close to 600 yards um, for $10.99 regular price. Um, but you can buy these on sale. I bought mine on sale at Joann's and I think I paid $8.99 at the time. So um, that is something that you can always think about is getting them on sale. So the main difference for me is um, I do like I don't know. They're both really, really pretty color-wise. Red Heart has this one beat. I mean, these are gorgeous colors that they come in. I can't. I mean, the colors are very, very gorgeous. I'm talking about the way that the ombre uh, lays itself out as from light to dark, so subtle that you can't even notice a change. Red Heart has uh, care on beat on that. But softness-wise, this feels really, really scraggly in comparison to this one. Um, but I like Red Heart uh, Ombre. It made it number 10 out of my top 10 favorite yarns of 2020, only because of the color of the ombre. I always thought it had the best ombre effect. Not because of the softness, because the softness is not there on, on that. But give it a good wash, it'll be better. I've made many, many things out of that. Um, so, which do I like better? Which do I prefer? There's really not much. Here's a pillow made out. You see how that ombre's out? That white just sticks out for some reason on that pillow. It just, I don't know, it just doesn't... Uh... I don't have this color I would show you, but you can see how that white on that blanket does not blend in well with those purples. Now it's not like that with the Red Heart. Their colors just fade naturally. I mean, it looks like it's white here, but it's just, it's such a subtle change from blue uh, medium, to dark to medium to light blue. It's very, very pretty. So I like them both, I do. Um, if I had to choose one, I would probably definitely choose Red Heart Super Saver. Um, not for the softness factor, but for the color change. Even though this is probably the second best I've ever seen from an ombre, um, it still doesn't beat Red Heart at all. Um, but the colors are pretty. The price is a little high on the uh, normal $10.99 if you can't get it on sale. They have limited colors in it. You know, they only have five which is but that's expectable with the new yarn you know they put out a new yarn they don't want to put out a bunch of colors in case it doesn't sell well red heart i got the ability to buy 18 20 different colors of it um all very pretty um and i can buy it anywhere that i want this is limited to joann's and yarn inspirations but um as as far as the way they crochet they both crochet the same they both are the exact same weight they both look of the exact same weight um, 
actually yeah they're, they're pretty much the same size and everything so yeah yeah my choice is going to be the red heart even though it does feel scraggly and itchy and not so cool i know that it will soften up once you wash it so i don't worry about that i will take red heart any day strictly on color price also even though this does have a bit more yardage the price at 10.99 is still too much for the yardage that they're asking um but if you get it on sale, um, it's probably okay. Like, I bought mine on sale. What did I say? I paid $8.99 or something for it. That's not bad. That's not bad for that. Of course, I'd pay $8.99 for this. Because that's just the way it is nowadays. You're into a lot higher than it used to be. So, um, that that's my comparison. Um, I'm not really going to do no crocheting with it. Because I can already tell you how it's going to turn out. They, they're going to crochet the same. It's just the the effect of the ombre is the only thing that's that's going to be different on them. And uh, other than the softness on this one. Uh, but despite that being um, the good factor on this one, Red Heart has it beat by colors by a mile. So I don't know if this was a good video. I don't know if it was even that informative. Don't get me wrong. I love the Carolyn Ombre. I think it's a very, very pretty. Um, I'm really favoring this one right here. It's called White Water. It's very, very pretty. I'm just not a fan of that white stripe down the middle. It just doesn't blend well. It doesn't ombre out well with the rest of it. It should have been more of a lighter blue, in my opinion. I don't know why they got white stripes in, in all of them. Now some, now some of the red hearts don't ombre out like that. You know, they got, like this one, it's gray and green. But most of them do have the subtle effect from light to dark. So that's what I like about them the best. And I would choose them any day over the Caron. But I like the Caron too. I don't think that I'll buy it again now that I have it. I just bought it to show you guys because it was new. I'll probably always stick with the Super Sayer, even though it's scratchy. Um... I'm still going to use it strictly color wise because it's beautiful. So that's it. Probably not too informative, but uh, check these out. Joanne's Yarn Inspirations is the only place I can find these if you haven't seen them yet. Um, there they are. Five colors available. Oh, these are made in India. These are made in the U.S. from imported fibers. So the fibers didn't come from the U.S., but they are made in the U.S. So that is it. I hope you enjoyed my non-informative video. I, I really didn't know what to say. I haven't done a yarn comparison in a long time and I can't. Maybe I should brush up on that. So <laughs> thanks everybody for watching. Hey, remember, let me know in the comments. I, I just want to say, let me know in the comments. Have you try, I tried both of these? If you have, which one do you prefer? Which one would you buy over the other? I know Caroline's softer, but I don't know. The color of the Red Heart Super Saver ombre has always been my favorite ombre out of all the ombres I've ever, ever touched in my life. Nothing's ever beaten that one. One will soon, I guarantee you. But for now, it's Red Heart. Thanks everybody for watching. Stay safe. Bye bye guys.